Welcome to ReneeEnergy.com on YouTube, the hub for all things renewable energy and sustainability. Our channel is dedicated to bringing you the latest innovations and insights in green energy, including cutting-edge developments like green hydrogen. Whether you're a sustainability veteran or just beginning your journey, we have something for everyone. Join us on this channel to explore inspiring projects for a sustainable tomorrow. We bring you the latest in renewable energy, sustainability, and cutting-edge technologies. And don't forget, for more in-depth information and resources, visit our website and subscribe to our newsletter for the latest updates and exclusive content. Welcome back to ReneeEnergy.com. Today, we're diving into an exciting innovation in green transportation, the introduction of Alstom's Caradia i Lint, the first hydrogen-powered passenger train to operate in North America. As the world transitions toward cleaner energy, green hydrogen is emerging as a key player, offering a sustainable alternative for sectors that are difficult to decarbonize, like rail transport. In this video, we'll explore how Alstom's Caradia i Lint is setting a new standard for zero-emission rail technology, and why this is a significant milestone in the push for greener public transportation. Alstom's Caradia i Lint first made headlines in 2018 when it debuted in Europe as the world's first hydrogen-powered train. The train has been in commercial service across various European countries, including Germany, Austria, and the Netherlands, covering more than 220,000 kilometers. It has proven its reliability and efficiency as a clean alternative to traditional diesel trains. However, what's making news now is the Caradia i Lint's recent introduction in North America, where it has completed a successful demonstration in Quebec. From mid-June to late September 2023, the Caradia i Lint operated passenger services in Quebec, transporting over 10,000 passengers and demonstrating its capability to deliver emission-free rail services. The train's performance was impressive, not only did it match the operational characteristics of standard regional diesel trains, but it did so with zero harmful emissions. The hydrogen fuel cell technology powering the Caradia i Lint converts hydrogen into electricity while emitting only water vapor and heat, making it one of the most environmentally friendly rail solutions available today. One of the key highlights of this trial was the environmental impact. Over the course of the demonstration, the Caradia i Lint saved more than 8,400 liters of diesel, preventing the emission of approximately 22 tons of carbon dioxide. The green hydrogen used to power the train was produced on-site using an electrolyzer operated by project partners, further enhancing the sustainability credentials of the entire operation. This success showcases how a complete green hydrogen ecosystem, from production and storage to utilization, can be integrated effectively into public transportation. But what exactly makes this train special? At first glance, the Caradia i Lint looks like a typical passenger train, but a closer look reveals that it's equipped with state-of-the-art hydrogen fuel cells, mounted on the roof of the train. These fuel cells convert hydrogen into electricity, which powers the train's propulsion system. Unlike conventional diesel engines, which produce carbon dioxide, nitrogen oxides, and particulate matter, the only byproducts of this process are water and heat. With a top speed of 140 km per hour and a range of up to 1,175 km on a single refueling, the Caradia i Lint offers the same performance as traditional diesel trains but without the environmental downsides. The hydrogen-powered Caradia i Lint is particularly well suited for non-electrified railway lines, which are still common in many regions, including parts of North America. Electrifying these lines is often expensive and logistically challenging. Hydrogen trains present a practical, cost-effective alternative, offering similar benefits to electrification without the need for costly infrastructure upgrades. This makes them an ideal solution for rural and regional rail routes, where diesel is still the primary fuel source. One of the most remarkable aspects of the Quebec trial was how seamlessly green hydrogen technology integrated with the existing rail infrastructure. The project was a collaborative effort involving multiple stakeholders, including Accelera by Cummins, which supplied the fuel cells and electrolyzer used in the project. Accelera's role was crucial in producing green hydrogen on-site, ensuring that the entire operation was truly zero emission. The electrolyzer, known as the HiStat 110, converts water into hydrogen using renewable energy, making it a sustainable source of fuel for the Caradia i Lint. This demonstration is not just a proof of concept, it's a significant step forward in the widespread adoption of hydrogen-powered trains in North America. The insights gained from this trial will be instrumental in advancing the development and deployment of hydrogen propulsion technology across the continent. For regions looking to decarbonize their rail networks but lacking the infrastructure for electrification, hydrogen trains present a compelling alternative. 
The success of this project could spark a broader movement towards zero emission rail solutions, particularly in areas where the cost of electrifying tracks is prohibitive. The Caradia I Lintz journey from Europe to North America is a testament to the growing global momentum behind green hydrogen as a key component in the energy transition. With governments increasingly setting ambitious climate targets, hydrogen powered trains like the Caradia I Lint are likely to become a common sight on railways worldwide. In fact, Alstom has already secured orders for 41 Caradia I Lint trainsets in Europe, signaling strong market interest in this technology. Beyond its environmental benefits, the Caradia I Lint also offers quieter and more comfortable rides for passengers. The train's fuel cells generate significantly less noise compared to diesel engines, making for a more pleasant travel experience. This is especially beneficial for communities living near rail lines, as it reduces noise pollution, a common concern with traditional trains. For industries and governments exploring green hydrogen as a solution for decarbonizing transportation, the Caradia I Lint serves as an excellent case study. It demonstrates that hydrogen trains are not only viable but also ready for large-scale deployment. The lessons learned from the Quebec trial provide valuable insights into the logistics of setting up hydrogen infrastructure, from production and storage to refueling and maintenance. If you're interested in learning more about green hydrogen technologies and their potential applications in transportation and beyond, ReneEnergy.com offers resources that can help. Our Green Hydrogen Development and Financing course covers essential topics, from hydrogen production methods to project financing and strategy. Whether you're working in energy, transportation, or just exploring the future of clean energy, this course provides valuable insights into this rapidly evolving field. As we look ahead, the success of projects like the Caradia I Lint in Quebec signals a brighter, cleaner future for public transportation. By embracing innovative solutions like hydrogen-powered trains, we can make significant strides toward reducing our carbon footprint while maintaining the convenience and efficiency of modern rail systems. Thank you for joining us today. If you found this video insightful, be sure to like, share, and subscribe for more content on clean energy and sustainable industry practices. To learn more about how you can get involved in the green hydrogen movement, visit ReneEnergy.com and explore our course offerings. Let's work together toward a sustainable, zero-emission future. Thanks for tuning into the ReneEnergy.com YouTube channel. We trust you found this episode enlightening and motivating. There's a world of innovation and opportunity in sustainable energy, and we're delighted to share this journey with you. Stay in the loop with the latest on renewable energy and sustainability by visiting our website and subscribing to our newsletter. Your support is immensely appreciated, it's truly invaluable to us. Don't miss our next video on new trends in renewable energy. Follow us on social media for the latest updates. Enjoy the video? Like, subscribe, and share for more green insights. Thanks for watching.